Help! Let me out! Let me out! I can't believe it. The cops have finally caught me. I'm in jail. Oh no! Help me get out. Who's going to post my bail? I'm afraid to bend over in the showers. I'm going to try and get out of this prison and show you around at the same time. If you're a big fan of urban exploration and you like that little bit of a China twist, be sure to hit subscribe and don't forget to ding 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 that bell for great new videos from Burbex, Brin's urban exploration every week. God, God, let me out, I'm innocent. Let's go. You can see that this is the Lamna Visitink room. I'm going to need a Lamia if I get caught in here. This of course is the interrogation room. China has a very bad reputation for interrogation methods. Trust me, you don't want to get caught by the police. They will probably torture you to get a confession out of you. Anything so that people can do jail time. And of course the psychological counselling room. If you don't need psychological counselling when you come in, you're definitely going to need it when you come out. It's funny to see all these hose pipes here. I can imagine the prisoners tying these hose pipes up to the windows and they're like rappelling out of the windows to get free. There's so much noise around here. I feel like I'm being followed a lot. I hope that uh, none of the cops next door are going to come in and catch me. If you look just over the roof there, you can see that there's a police station right next door and there's a few lazy security guards outside the police station. We are literally right next to a police station. It would be dead easy for me to get caught right now.
you can see that every one of these cells has got an intercom. Presumably that's so that if there's trouble, like maybe one of your cellmates wants to beat the crap out of you, you can press it and get out of trouble. It looks like the last time this prison was open was in 2013 and you can see this prisoner's schedule written on the blackboard. Also, I think it's interesting that there's these chains on the wall. It makes me wonder if some of the prisoners here were shackled up to prevent them escaping. You can't see it at first glance, but actually you can see behind me there's this row where the bars have been cut off. And so this would have been a barred cell at one point. This is actually really weird. I'm trying to get out through the first floor and there's puppies locked in the cells everywhere. One cell has got two puppies, the other cell has got three puppies. And I've got a very strong feeling that these animals are going to be eaten. I think they're fattening them up to eat. It's not very common in Shanghai, but a lot of the countryside people who might be squatting in this building might be raising these puppies for meat. Now I have a dilemma. My dilemma is whether to go in and see if I can steal some puppies because they're not in good shape here. I'm going to open all the doors so that the dogs can escape. You're free. You're free. Get out of here. shaking right now. I just released all the puppies. Hopefully they're going to get out of the cells and escape. They're making a lot of noise. I hope I didn't attract any attention. Shit. I just saw the puppy woman. The dog farmer. I released the dogs. I've got to try and get out of here without getting caught now. She's right downstairs.